I think a lot has been said, but simply to say extrajudicial killings cannot be warranted, will not be warranted in this government or in any other government. It goes against the universal human rights. It's wrong, it's uncalled for, whether politically or just on a normal day. I think the demonstrations we have are beyond Raila Odinga or any other person. I think as it is, Kenyans are oppressed, Kenyans are feeling the pain, and this goes beyond any political leader. And what we are asking is that the president and his people will see through the people's eyes as they campaigned over uh, the people's platform, the hustler narrative. We want to believe that they should use the same ear and the same intelligence they had to know that people were hungry, the same intelligence they had to know that people were struggling, to understand the situation is the same. And killing our young men will not be the solution towards the economic uh, crisis that we have at the moment. We are saddened, we are feeling the pain as the people of Nakuru County. To lose our young boys, very strong, capable, and ready to serve this nation, who have been shot dead, for standing against an injustice. We are feeling so unfortunately sad that the government, instead of standing with these families, instead of understanding the pain, the much they have said is that they will continue. Or rather, the president has stood and congratulated the police for killing. It is uncalled for, it's uncouth, and we will not stand by it. So that is what we have to say, but it's, this means we remain vigilant as a people, we remain vigilant um, as a county and realize that we are on our own, more or less. So again, my sincere condolences to the family, and we really hope that this will not repeat itself. My name is Shiko Kihika, a human rights defender in Akuru County, serving a tribal youth.